What? Okay, I'm gonna cover from PK until he comes back, but we got a really good set. Hey, it was good. We got a really good set to go, man. Heady against Heady versus Dej. This is not the two people that you said, PK. No. <laughs> <It's not. laughs> hey, you know I, that was a, that was a test. You feel me? You had to had to test see if you were paying attention. Uh, That's course, hilarious. And of course, we got Dej. Uh, excited to see a small battlefield, a surprisingly good stage for Sephiroth, uh, and a very good stage, of course, for uh, for Sonic. Mm -hmm. This is, this is power versus evasion, I'd say, for this matchup. Uh, yeah, unfortunate. Very, uh, unfortunate for Sephiroth. Yeah, exactly. He's going to get overwhelmed. Uh, Sephiroth has trouble with the faster characters in the cast, solely because the uh, startup of their moves, as well as the end lag from their moves, just makes them very volatile. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's tough, because... Uh, a lot of what Step Rock uh, gets a lot out of is Nair. And uh, you have to wait your turn, essentially, to even do things. But, woo! That was crazy. He tried to follow him all the way up to the last zone. He's going to get that spin dash forward air. 48% Dage is starting off very strong. Not even letting Eddie use the wing. Not at all, and uh, that's the one of the more important parts of this matchup. I mean, Sephiroth can normally kill Sonic pretty fast, but uh, it won't be as consistent with Outwing, and the speed boost that you get with the one-wing game is really important to keep up with the pace of Sonic. Does. Most definitely, as well as I feel like Sephiroth's best killing move being down, I'm uh, sorry, back air, is going to be very hard to space on Sonic. It's, it's kind of short. Yeah, and another big thing I think is important to this matchup is Sephiroth falling up air is really good to stop pursuers from like just getting too comfortable getting in your face. So if you can't pull out the back air as much, if you want to cover all your options, definitely falling up air uh, will be a part of that. Put a wave in uh, on that platform. Today, is very, very good right now. Yeah. They're doing a very phenomenal job at putting on the pressure, not allowing Hetty to even put any set play. Okay, it feels like a feels lot like of these are stray attacks. It's just anything that you can throw out against Sonic Speed, and that forward smash is going to catch the jump on the shield. Not that fun to play at all. No, I'm gonna have to go right now. Finally finding the first stock with a uh, uh, falling up. Here. If Hetty wants a chance in this matchup, if Hetty wants a chance in this matchup, they're going to have to hit when to approach Sonic, as well as know how to wall him out because it seems like um, Dej is going to camp, circle camp your shield forever he will not stop it seems like he's always going to hold forward so you have to prepare for the approach because Dej is going to approach real quick can we talk about how fire that Sephiroth tattoo is on Hedy was that a set I thought that was Itachi I think that was Sephiroth because Hedy's the one that in the red if I'm not mistaken and we're seeing a character switch, uh, which is super yeah, important it was needed yeah, because Sephiroth, I mean, you want to be able to keep up with Sonic's mobility a little bit better. And uh, you want to keep the kill power, but there's no better character than that. Mm -hmm. And the speed, too. The the speed that you can use with Wolf is going to be to um, hide his, um, Hedy's benefit, sorry. Yeah, and some of these trades that have been happening, especially with Nair, uh, they're more, much more worthwhile with uh, Wolf. The problem is, however, being off stage with Wolf. You know, that's one of the only things you're going to have to deal with. Danger zone, so to speak, against Sonic. Yeah, because the Wolf Flash is like the farthest recovery you can get, and it's, it's very tough to use, not very easy to recover with. So let's see what Hetty can do. Of course, they had a plan when they picked Wolf, and uh, it's, it's working right now. They're doing fairly good, but they're just going to have to find themselves more B&Bs, and uh, maybe an up smash or down smash here and there. Dave, still going for that uh that upbeat up air. He can be very, very good. He hasn't been able to hit it yet, but I like the fact that he keeps threatening it. 
and then you get back. And Sonic actually has to respect Wolf's uh, recovery a little bit more. It doesn't have that hitbox. Yeah. That was crazy. He took him for a ride and he's going to escort them right to the blast zone. The, the, back, the back throw, 66% on Dej. Who's... Go ahead. I mean, uh, Dage is looking fantastic, you know. I don't think the game plan is switched up too much for Dage. Hedy, no. however, um, even though I think the Wolf is a good pick, if you've only been playing a certain character in bracket, to switch over to someone that you might not have warm can be to your death. Yeah, it's like it, the Wolf is looking a little cold, and, uh, you know, Dage is playing Sonic all day. Yeah, I, I'm not seeing a uh, Wolf dash attack that much, which is nuts. I think that's one of the best dash attacks in the game. Or an up smash, which is or like one of the best up smashes in the game. As soon as I say that, they go for the up smash. Just trying to take a stock any means possible. And it's going to get caught with an F smash. That was a meaty F smash from Dej. What's Woodsy there? He was like, ah, left, right, left, right, fist. Ah, landing. <laughs> For free in this economy? Yeah, look at that turnaround grab. Dej is looking for a three stock right now. No way. Ooh, no, don't do it to him. Trying to get yeah. the back air after the spin dash. Not going to give it to him. 96%. Now Hetty is looking very, very uncomfortable in this situation. Going to get hit with the back air. Punishment. Was that a pop off? Uh, I mean, I don't know if that was necessary, but I don't understand if he played really well. Nah, probably not, but he got up immediately. He's like, I'm done. My work here has been done. Yeesh. Dash grabs in, in Smash Ultimate are like some of the most punishable things that mm -hmm. you can do. If you whiff a dash grab,